back to the Matara Kitchen. I'm Kat and today we are going to make street style Tom Yum noodle salad. Yum mama! The summer is approaching, the weather is getting warmer and that is why we are thinking of having some yummy street food from the tropical Bangkok. Today's dish, Yam Mama, is something you can find easily on the streets of Bangkok. You usually find uh, these push carts on the street and the seller will display all different kinds of ingredients that you can pick and choose and add it into the salad. They will make it with the mama noodles together with the ingredients you picked, cook it all up, toss it all up and then serve. Today we will be making the vegan Yam Mama and the ingredients that I'm showing today can easily be swapped or replaced with whatever you like. So let your creativity flow and experiment with this recipe. It's quite flexible. Okay, so now let's run through the ingredients list. We will need the vegetarian Tom Yam Mama noodles, cabbage, tomatoes, red onion, coriander, mock meat of your choice. So for today's recipe, I have chosen impossible meat and also some vegetarian fish balls for the texture. We will also need uh, rice vinegar. If you don't have rice vinegar, you can use uh, lemon or lime. And we'll also need some vegan fish sauce. All right, that's all for today's ingredient. Let's start cooking. Now first we need to prep some of the ingredients and the first one we'll need to prepare is the red onion. So we'll need one whole red onion and we just need to slice it. Set them aside. Next we will dice up one tomato. We want to remove the poppy center. Next, we will chop up one good bunch of coriander. Here I have a cabbage, but we'll only use like a few pieces of the leaves. So let me just peel maybe three pieces of the cabbage. And I'm only going to peel it with my hands into smaller pieces and I wouldn't use the core because it's kind of hard so I only save the tender parts of the leaves just going to keep it more rustic and then continue to peel them into smaller pieces like bite-sized pieces okay check the size all right good I'll keep this aside. I have some vegetarian fish balls here and I'll just slice them into smaller pieces. These vegetarian fish balls, they give a nice chewy and crunchy texture, much like calamaries and the shrimp that is commonly found in this dish. And lastly, I will pound one red chili with a mortar and pestle. So, be right back. Okay, I'm back and here is the pounded red chili. If you cannot take spice, you can skip this step. If you can really take spice, then you can swap out a regular red chili with a bird's eye chili or chili putty. That will definitely increase the heat. The seasoning from the Mama Instant Noodle already has a bit of a heat, but I think you can amp it up a little bit. So it's really up to you 
how much chili or whether you want to put chili or not and I think pounding is better than just chopping it up because the juice of the red chili will then mix well with the other elements in the noodle so it's just better it feels more integrated okay now we are done prepping let's start cooking okay we will first prepare the impossible meat so just a very simple stir fry in your hot pan add about a tablespoon of oil just add in the impossible meat so next we are going to add some of the ingredients into the mixing bowl first so first I will add the onions tomatoes and the coriander yes I'll add everything and also add the chili paste mix it up a little bit okay next we will be adding the seasoning from the mama noodles so for two serving i'm using four packets of mama noodles so we add everything in now toss this all up we also need a few splashes of rice vinegar don't need much and one teaspoon of vegan fish sauce and also add in the impossible meat that we just fried up now we'll keep this mixture aside and we will move on to cooking the last bits and they are the vegan fish balls, the cabbage and the noodles now in the pot of boiling water I will first add in my vegetarian fish balls let that cook for a minute all right then i'll add in the cabbage next i'll add in all four packets of the noodles Let's take everything out from the pot. Ooh la la, ooh la la. Now let's toss them all up. Ooh. Look at the colors and we are done! Let's serve! Street style tom yum noodle salad yum mama Shall we do a taste test? Woohoo! Mmm. Oh, so good. This is proper yum mama. It is so good. The fresh onion, it's so good with the noodles as well as the coriander. I think these two really make the dish come alive. Tomato is good with a pop of freshness. Cabbage gives it a good crunch and sweetness. I am more of a soup person and you know hands down anytime I'll go for a soup noodle dish but I gotta say this is probably the best way to have mama noodles have it dry toss it up like a salad add things that you like 
the, in, the key items that you need to add will be the red onion, the coriander, the tomatoes, and if you want, add the chili. I think these are the must-have. Everything else around it, the protein or the other vegetables, you can add as you like. You can add in enoki mushroom or pan-fried oyster mushroom. You can even try it with tofu. Like I said, experiment and let your creativity flow. All right, we have come to the end of today's video. Street style tom yum noodle salad, yum mama. I really hope you give this recipe a try. I know sometimes it can be a bit hard to find the mama noodles, but feel free to try it out with other vegan or vegetarian uh, tom yum noodles that you can find wherever you are. And if you've liked today's video, do give us a like and subscribe to our channel. If you have tried today's recipe, do let us know how it turned out. Okay, I'm going to have my lunch now. So I'll see you in the next one. Bye!